Hello guys, and welcome back to Black Mirror 2. So, last set, I was going to start with that chest, and these items, and Dark Paladin 300, if I remember your name correctly, um, kind of pointed me towards the good idea. He kind of said, well, if the paper is greasy enough, you can, uh, yeah probably absorb whatever is well whatever pattern or fingerprint or whatever and then use the charred piece of wood basically the charcoal to uh, reveal it which got me to go back to the chest and so I went well lock no wait decorations the yes. circles are recessed into the wood that means that they must be able to be traced on the paper using a piece of charcoal. Hey, worked well. You can easily recognize the circles as well as the lines. Alright, what do we got? Traced carving. What if the circles on the chest are simplified notes? Notes which just give the pitch but not the duration of the note. Ah, uh, well I'm guessing that has something to do with the piano, right? I mean, what else? The piano is usable because it kept, you know, popping up, so... Could the circles on the chest be simplified notes? Notes which just give the pitch, not the duration? If they really are notes, then there's a starting point missing. Perhaps you can begin anywhere, and just have to pay attention to the relative pitch of the notes with one another. I generally don't hope so. Music is not my forte, I'd say. Wait, what? Oh boy. So, what's... Essentially all of these are... I... Dude, no. You cannot do this to me. I I generally have no idea here. God, what? Do it for me. Seriously. Oh yes, this is clearly it. No? Ugh, come on. Alright, I guess I'll have to be back whenever I figure this out because I am not even going to try this because I have no idea about this. So, be right back guys, be right back. Alright, I think I got it and I was actually pretty much on the right track. You know, it's pretty much just, that is just the left and that is far right. So it's like that, 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 that. And then it goes all the way to the right. Well, is it one of, well it's gotta be that one, right? No, I think that's wrong. Yeah. Alright, let's... Uh, shouldn't that be around there? No, not really. Oh, God. Well, this is essentially what I've been doing. Oh, come on, it's... Gotta be one of those. That one. No? Oh, come on, this is ridiculous. I hate this. I am not in favor of this. Did I try that one? Yes, I did. Well, that bit is correct. Has to be. So that looks like it's three notes over. One, two, three. That is that one. So let's try two then. Now let's say that is on that note. Oh, wait, I'm supposed to do this. Idiot. Idiot. No. 
Thank God. I think I didn't make any mistakes. Hmm. Three, two, Always five. The same note. Three, two, five. I guess right. Counting the amount of tones. Or the amount of times. Well, let's try that. Bloody hell! I I will probably have cut stuff out of there because I think I got it, but then I screwed up. So yeah. Uh, I'll have cut that in some way. Uh, yeah, let's look at the lock. Three, two, five. Sounds like it's done something. Yeah, unlocked. <laughs> Gosh. Got it. Combination worked. All right. There's my stuff. All right, I'll just take this stuff. I probably won't need the rest anymore. How do you? How do you know that? Display cabinet key. That's the key for the display case in the museum. Right, right, right. Bobby accidentally dropped it from his pocket. Yes, right. I was gonna like, wait, what's that key? But yeah, right. Uh, so yeah, let's exit. Seems about the right time. Ooh, that's kinda... Nice and bright. Oh, great. What are you doing? Wonderful. I'm in the middle of nowhere. The next house could be miles away, and Tom could be back at any minute. So perhaps get away from the front I think door. I better find out where I am first. If Tom does come back, I can always jump into the bushes. Right. Let's see. So into the castle. B wait, boy. I didn't see boy there. Holy shit! But for a statue and or something. Whoever over there. the guy is, and judging by his clothing. I bet he never reckoned on ending up standing in a swamp. No, probably not. Not long now and you'll see this place is one green sea of plants. Mm, boards. And castle. What a dump. The castle looks like it's been fighting a battle with nature for the past ten years. And lost. I can't believe that someone still lives here. Everything's so... Run down and overgrown. All right, boards. Is that the room? No, because I was upstairs. Only this window has been nailed shut. The others were left unprotected and so for the most part are broken. It looks like the occupiers moved out in a hurry. <laughs> or they didn't care about what happened to the castle. Certainly you would. There's a lot of money in that, so... Yeah, even if something scary is in there, then... I mean, you still care, right? You just don't go run off with no money, no nothing, so... Well, let's talk to Boy, who was very well hidden. Still is. The boy's around 12 years old, I guess. Looks like he could be watching me. Well, I don't know, I really can't see any... Uh, well, he, he's kind of staring off that direction, I think. Hey, kid! I know you're there. Come out, I'm not gonna hurt you. You couldn't anyway. I'm much too quick for you. If you say so. I'm Darren Michaels, a mighty physics student. I'm Van Helsing. Whoa, uh, the vampire hunter? I always thought you were a bit older, sir. <laughs> Nicely played, Darren. Nicely played. Also, was it me, or did that I'm a mighty physics uh, student? Did that sound just a bit too much? Like, gosh, I am someone, and I'm a mighty pirate? Very much did. Very much did, didn't it? So I guess that was their uh, Monkey Island thing. So, yeah, right. Maybe it was not supposed to be, but it very much came out like that. Uh, 
let's ask about the toy, because obviously that's most important. I saw some toys in the castle. Are they yours? Yes, all my things. And my car. I got that for my birthday. From who? I daren't go in there since those men have been there. You better not. They're dangerous. Well, one is. Are they werewolves? Uh, no. Uh, but they kidnapped me. Cool. <laughs> Gosh, kid, you are such an asshole. Can you tell me where I am? What's this castle? Eh? It's the old Gordon's place. The Gordons? From Willow Creek? Willow Creek? I don't know what you're talking about. Sir Richard and Lady Eleanor used to live here. What? And where are we exactly? Where? In Wales. What? Oh, great. Shouldn't you be talking crazy then? Because Welsh to me is alien. Very, very alien. But yeah, let's uh, ask about the brothers. Have you seen the two men who are living in the castle now? Yes. Nasty men. <laughs> you bet. One of them chased me. Said he would call the police if I don't disappear. I'm sure he wouldn't do that. The woman was much nicer. Woman? Which woman? The pretty one. I see. Right. She was here a few weeks ago. She was snooping around and asked me about the summer house and the laboratory. And then she went. She took some blood samples with her. Strange. Uh, did, did she tell you her name? Or what she planned to do with them? She needed the blood for research. Angelina said. Whoa, wh what? For research. Maybe she's a vampire hunter too. W what did the woman look like? Well, like a woman. Pretty. Like this? Did she look like this? Yes, that's her. But she had long blonde hair when she was here. I liked her much more like that. Long blonde hair. A and when did you say she was here? It was before my birthday. About four weeks ago. Long before we coincidentally bumped into each other in Biddeford. Well, plot twist yet again? Damn. Okay, this... I'm... So very curious what is, as to what is really going on here. Well, let's go ask about her some more. What exactly did the woman do when she was here? Looked at the castle in the summer house, especially the house. Do you know what she did there? Looked for something, and I think she tried to get into the old laboratory. At some point, she gave up and started searching at the tomb in the marshes. I had to go home, because it was starting to get dark. When I came back the next day, she walked past me, coming from the summer house. She had a bag of blood in her hand and was very happy. And then, she left. Sounds very strange, but... Yeah, I don't know. What kind of summer house is that? It's all ruins. Blew up. Really? Yes. Long time ago, my father says that old Sir Richard died in the explosion. He had his laboratory in the summer house. He was a scientist. I think he was a vampire. Really? Of course. He experimented with blood. Who else does that kind of thing? Maybe you're right. And they gave up the castle after the explosion? Maybe. That was ten years ago. Since I've been coming here, the castle has always been empty. Listen, uh, Van Helsing, C can you do me a favor and keep watch for the car and, and the other man coming back? I need to have a look around here and, uh, I need a lookout. Of course! Nothing gets past me. Why? Excellent. Why would that kid help us? It can't possibly be a coincidence. Angela snoops around the Gordon estate I discover a connection to this very family in Biddeford. Did Angelina lie to me? The question is, did she have a good reason, or, or does she work for the Order? I can't leave you.